Good evening, everybody. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my stream. Welcome to the world. How is everybody? Today, I'm on the Thirsty Ferret, which is the last of Jim's uh, owls that he sent me. Jim can't be on tonight. He's already texted me. So, uh, cheers, Jim. I hope you're enjoying your uh, shift tonight. Oh, this is much nicer than yesterday's one, I have to say. Um, we had a weird day today, as you saw in my little Miss Marple video. The, um, the police come and took all of that stuff in the end. Um, the, the, the big bag was definitely an Amazon bag, and uh, I know some people confirmed that. Apparently, we did have a couple of Amazon trucks to, uh, sort of like, I don't know, robbed, <laughs> I guess the word is, burgled uh, in the Corby area. So uh, it's probably got something to do about that. But uh, I don't know. Most of the stuff in the bag looked like it just been stolen out of a car because it was cheap, you know, like a, I don't know what they, uh, the, the things you plug into a diagnostic tool for a car. There was a sat nav, um, a uh, dash cam, uh, but then there was this laptop, this Sony Vio laptop, which it must be from when I worked in PC worlds, they're well over a thousand pound and it had the Onyx screen and everything. So, uh, but I thought, you know, what? I'm not touching that. So <laughs> we'll have to see. <laughs> Ah, uh, anyway, so um, what have you noticed tonight? Can you notice anything? <laughs> Look, check that out. That's what's coming tomorrow. We've got pretty much every single bit of bodywork for the Super Snake. This is ginormous. As a matter of fact, oh. check that out. <laughs> Look at it. How cool is that? I'm going to put it back because I don't want to break it. Oh. So we've got that. Uh, and we've also got go over here we've got the bonnet with the vents and the grill headlights all ready to start putting electrics in for that we've got uh, just some little details there we've got all of the rear tail lights looking like that and the electrics we've got the metal rear tail light section there we've got the spoiler or a little tiny spoiler going on the back again all this metal in one pack more electrics there and then finally we've just got some of the vents which will be going on to the bodywork there uh, that is coming tomorrow let me just put that to one side um it came from uh dpd you know what i've just realized you didn't see any of that did you you didn't see any of that because i didn't transition over oh god you know what i'm gonna do it again sorry that's my mistake right try that again <laughs> vents as you can see there We've got electrics looking just like that. We've got uh, the spoiler. This is metal. We've got the rear tail lights looking just like that. We have got the lights uh, that go in the rear of the tail lights and all the electrics there. Loads of tiny little, those tiny little details down the bottom there. Uh, we've got a few more details in that pack. And then we've got the really, really heavy one, the bonnet the vents the grills the headlights everything so uh wow <laughs> that's going to be coming tomorrow i don't know how long that's going to take to build i actually thought this one was going to be a really quick build but uh, i've looked at the instructions quite a lot came from dpd the box was ginormous the box is uh well box site is big so uh, I'm guessing anyone who's getting the Super Snake will probably get them posted out specially. Um, they are packed really well. The whole bodywork was in foam, uh, polystyrene. Um, but when we do it, you're going to want to make sure, I don't know where mine is, you do this on a towel because you don't want to scratch that bodywork. But wow, it's big. Very, very big. <laughs> Be right back, build an extension to my house for the Eleanor. <laughs> so, um... That's the first thing that's going to be going on. The second thing that we're going to be doing probably next week now is uh, Mike Lane. Look, we've got some Twinkies. <laughs> See, look, the excitement is building and it does say, look, a, a big crossed out tiny Twinkie. That'd be good to have in the Ecto-1. And we are also going to be installing the carpets. So this is the carpet mod here. for the footwheels with a heel pad as well. So they're going to be going in to the ecto one so that's going to be next week so it seems like every week at the moment we're getting a new mod coming out uh, i'm a little bit confused about the mods though because like mike lane's done a grill i believe mr fusion design's done a grill and i think uh scout mods has done a grill so i think i don't know 
I don't know if people are doing their own thing now or I, I'm, I'm so confused with it all. I'm telling you, I'm just confused with where all of these mods are coming from. I don't get it at all, to be honest with you. So, but tonight we're going to be doing issue 85 of the Terminator. And this, as I said, is the last issue that we're going to be doing for quite a while. And it's quite a tricky one because we're actually uh, attaching the hand to the arm, which means we're doing the springs. Now, I'll tell you now, before you think I've gone wrong, when I do the springs, I'm going to be crossing over the middle ones. I'm not keeping them straight. I liked them crossed over on the original arm, on the left, uh, on the right arm. So I'm going to do the same on the left arm. So when it comes to me attaching the strings, the two middle ones I'm intentionally crossing over. Okay, I'm not going to keep them straight. I don't know why. It just looks like a twisted muscle. So uh, that's good. But I think this one's going to take a little bit of time. But uh, who knows? How is everyone tonight? What have you all been up to today? Tell me what you've been up to today. Because my day's just gone from weird to weirdness. Tomorrow, as I said, I'm going to be doing... Um, what are we going to do in the morning? <laughs> I think, because we did two... Uh, I might do a Bismarck tomorrow, I think. I've got some Bismarcks to do. I'm going to do a Bismarck tomorrow, and then that's pretty much me uh, until I get... Uh, no, I'm not doing a Bismarck tomorrow. I'm going to do a Bismarck Friday, because I'm building that tomorrow. <laughs> See what I mean? That's the first ferret. Um, I'm building that tomorrow. So I'm building that, that, probably, that won't probably be up to about just after midday. So then we'll have the, uh, the Shelby Super Steak Pack 11 completed. It's going to look great on there when it's finished. Look at it. Look at it. It looks great. Uh, so yeah, Friday we'll do the Bismarck, but uh, there's going to be no videos this weekend. That's if there is a video Friday. I don't know what, what, what state I'm going to be in. Getting up really early to get Mrs. Welder away into the hospital. Don't know what time she's going down, but as soon as I know something, then I'll put it on here and let you know how she is. Uh, realistically, I don't think we're going to be... You're working eight hours today, Pete. Oh, God. Hello, Christian from Grantham. Everyone's working. What do you mean while you're working? Um, I, don't, I, I don't think we're going to hear anything back from the hospital till Friday afternoon in the UK. But uh, I don't know. I've reinforced my gate in my garden. So one of the gates, because I've got two gates access to the garden... One of the gates, I've got planks and I've basically just bolted, I've screwed it shut so no one can get in the gate anymore. They couldn't anyway, but I'm just being conscious that why would you leave that big bag of stuff in the garden if you're either not coming back for it or be getting someone else to come back for it? Enough, nothing makes sense today at all. So I'm just covering my own back, the workshop's locked, all the gates are locked, so the lights are on, everything's on, the security cameras are on. So You've been break dancing, Eric. <laughs> I used to break dance back in the day, you know, I have a bit of cardboard underneath my arm and lie it down and spinning on my back and doing the caterpillar and all that. <laughs> That's right, Graham Logan, the, the shops opened, didn't they? X was shopping an absolute nightmare for months and my wallet went mad. Your day was spent waiting for 911 and ordering Mike Lane's carpets right now. Ooh, for the 911, that's the police, yeah, Burgess? I think <laughs> I don't know Graham how's that how's that Daniel LaRusso coming on Graham Graham has been uh, working on like a, a Daniel LaRusso um, figurine and oh wow he, when you showed it me oh uh, what did the police say they they all the food that was in that bag Alan they they said we can't do anything with that they chucked that um, and then they think the bag come from an Amazon robbery but all the stuff in the bag is definitely from some sort of robbery. But they didn't want to touch it. They all had their gloves on. So they just took it away, basically. To be honest with you, they, out of like the half an hour they were here, 10 minutes was talking about all the stuff that was found in the garden. The other 20 minutes was petting Phoebe, who was like, Ah, people, <laughs> pay attention to me. So um, it is funny how Phoebe can just turn everyone's heads and uh, make them <laughs> make them pay attention to her. I wish I could break dance again. Not so easy for 50 year olds to do that. You tried. Oh, Eric, back in the day, I was supple, 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 that word. You know, I could do the, the crab on your back where you're arching your back and all. I don't think I could do any of that anymore. I don't think I could run 50 meters anymore. <laughs> I've, uh, I need to get fit. I was losing weight. We, both me and Mrs. World Away were doing really well. But uh, yeah, then life got in the way, unfortunately. <laughs> Oh, the model space, 1-8 Porsche. I thought you were calling the police burg this. What is it with model space? I don't know if anyone noticed, but model space did a Black Friday event, but everything was sold out. <laughs> so it's like, what are you selling? I'm uh, a little bit confused. 
So like, it, it got concerned because the HMS Victory is sold out according to that. But they were advertising on their site, so it doesn't. Just waiting for parts, Graham. Oh, all well, good. So I, I, I don't know what that's all about. But anyway, we're gonna get cracking on this Terminator. So uh, I haven't, let me get my, my chat set up. Hang on a second, stand by. And that way I can, uh, I can get on with building while chatting to you. So I've got my Kindle here. I just need to, I should have had this set up really, shouldn't I? Uh, I just need to log in if it works. Hopefully it will. It's probably gonna ask me to log in because I haven't been on this for so long. I press that button there. I press that button there. And uh, hopefully, somebody type something. <laughs> I think it's working. Look, see, this is my chat screen here. Look, this is what I see on my computer here. Slightly different to what you guys see, because this is basically normally an amalgamation of. Oh, there we go. Look, it's chatting now. It's normally an amalgamation of Twitch and uh, Twitter and Facebook all in one place. So I can see all the chat in one place. But because this is a, a, an unlisted stream and it's only for the YouTube, as you can see, all we're going to get is YouTube tonight. So when I do respond back to you in chat, if I was to say like, uh, hello, it will come from World of Wayne rather than Restream. See? On the stream there. It's quite clever. <laughs> but we're going to be extending the lower left arm and connecting it to the hand. Um, again, they're doing this slightly different because I remember before we had to put the little plastic things on the springs and then glue it to the hand. But now they want it to do it the other way around. They want us to put the little plastic things in the hand and then glue the springs to them. I don't know if that's right or not, but who knows. So, let's get cracking. Okay, this is what we've got. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take all of these little grommets out of here. I've already opened the bag with the grommets and the screws in. That's one, two. A plastic naked body and gee. <laughs> Three. Okay. So just like last time, what we're going to do is we're going to try and find the bigger side of this grommet, which is that side, I believe. Oh, God. I don't know. I think it's that side. Yep. And we'll get a screw. And we're going to screw that in there, just like so. Personally, I don't think these grommets do much at all, to be honest with you, but there you go. They want us to put them on, so we're going to put them on. Pick this one. This one's going on that. Whoa. That one's going on. Oh, oh, God. I shouldn't have had the thirsty ferret. I can't see which way around this is supposed to go. I think it's that way. Yep. Right. I haven't got my uh, glasses on tonight, my big magnifying glasses, but I'm probably going to be needing them. I can't even hold a uh, a screw properly tonight. What is going on with me? There we go. And then we'll put this one in like that. Number two. Oh, and Phoebe's decided she wants to come in now. Well, you'll have to wait, Phoebe. Nothing's happening. <laughs> And Mrs. Wilder Wayne's frantically calling Phoebe. Mark Smith, you cancelled mine and got money back. Her based on previous experience, I bet you have to contact them. What was that for? Oh, the McLaren F1 car. I don't know what's going on with uh, model space and their stocks. It just seems very strange. There we go. So we've done all three of those there. Okay, next thing we're going to do is we're going to be cutting off these tiny little details oops when i get it out on here now we've got four of these so get me sprue cutters on here one two do the other side three four so that's completely empty i always show you that that's empty because i've got a habit of chucking things away that i actually need then we'll get the top here one and the other side here. Two. <laughs> Phoebe's putting me off tonight, big time. <laughs> Phoebe, go downstairs. It's not time. Okay, we do this side as well. There we go, and that's the little tiny things there. Okay, now it wants me to put these in the hand we've got here in the little square holes that we can see at the bottom with the rectangular side of this, whoops, going into the hole. 
and the pointed side of this facing down here that's what the springs are going to go into so for that i'm going to need to get some glue on here so i'm going to fill one of these little troughs up with some glue just like that i've got me dabber it's just a dress pin as i said in a pin vise and i'm going to put these in one at a time so that's the first one there i'm going to try and do this without tweezers so uh you know good luck with that uh my eyesight is terrible <laughs> i might have to put my uh glasses on let me uh let's see if i can get that in nope not having it try again i don't want to use my tweezers because this is ah there we go that's the first one in there you go so it should look just like uh let me point to it so you can see so it should look just like that there so let's do the other three one here i will look at chat in a minute i promise this is uh this is concentration time <laughs> right here's the second one let me move this thumb right back oh that don't help really oh that's better Oh, number two's got in fine. Holding that into place. There we go. So that's two in. Next one. You have permission from the boss to buy the glasses from the Amazon site. Those glasses are brilliant. They're actually right next to me. I should really put them on, shouldn't I? You know what? I'll, uh, I will do that. I will put the glasses on because I can't see what I'm doing at all, to be honest with you. And I'll even put the light on. There's that. There we go. <laughs> okay. Now I can see what I'm doing. I'm sure. Okay. I'm going to have to pick this up. And get this one in. Oh, it's a lot easier when you can actually see what you're doing. He says. There you go. That's the third one. Much easier. <laughs> right. I think that's all the glue that we need in this one. I'm just going to put the fourth one in, which goes in side here uh, line this up in my hands and we'll put that in the little square hole down here there we go excellent so all four of those have gone in absolutely perfect so I can take these off there don't need the glasses on what's the next thing we're going to do uh, next thing we're going to do is going to bring over the arm looking just like that we're going to be sliding up all of these sections here into these here so we've got one there one there and the last one over here like that oh very uh oh did you like that noise <laughs> so there in now what now it wants us to take the hand assembly i'm just going to line this up we want to put these cables here through the hand assembly but as i said i am going to they're straight at the moment i'm going to cross over the middle ones now so the left one goes in there this one's going to go in the third one along the second one here is going to go into so the third one's going to go into the second one because i'm crossing them over and then the last one We'll just go where it's supposed to go in the last one. Let me just have a look at that. Yeah, I've got the cross in there. Excellent. Uh, now, they want us to put all of these sections onto these ball joints here. Uh, but they want us to put a little bit of oil just on the big one. They didn't tell us to do that first off either. So I have got some oil on this cotton bud here. And I think that'll be the first one we put in. I'm trying to do it without putting any of these things out. There we go, make sure they're all still in. Yep. So I'll put the biggest ball joint in first by rocking it around. There we go, that's gone in perfectly. Then push this one down a bit. We're going to put this one in here, like that. This one in here, and then this one. Oops, get in there, in there, like that. There we go, that is the hand on. And all that leaves us to do is to put these springs making short work of this aren't i 
into the little points that we just put in there so we do need some more glue are those shoulder joints loose no no see i can hold them okay yeah those glasses are a godsend uh where's my little uh oh, there it is now from what i remember this is the hardest bit I'm trying to get this to attach so i'm going to put some glue down the end just like that then i'm going to sort of twist it onto here clockwise i'm going to need tweezers for this aren't i hang on i'm going to try oh i think that's going in it looks like it's going in i am going to use tweezers to help me though uh there they are just a little bit of there we go perfecto so that's the first one let's do the second one again grab it pull it drop some glue down here stick it in me tweezers uh probably yeah i'll put it that way around and then put it over here hmm it's going to be a bit tricky this one i think it's better doing it the way that i used to do it uh try again nope oh dear i'm going very quiet now because i can see this is gonna take a little while uh, I'm using the wrong tweezers for this. Uh, okay, stand by. Hopefully, I've got my other set of tweezers in here. I've got to look. A lot of my stuff is actually in the. Uh... Bear with me. A lot of my stuff is in the uh, workshop. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear, no. Okay, I'm gonna have to make do with what I got. Damn it! Right, okay. All right, it's going on now. I think the glue dried in it. Let's uh, put some actually on this bit. Did anyone else have problems with this bit? <laughs> Try again. There we go. That's the second one on. Let's do the third one. down there holding it right near the end because i don't want to pinch the spring too much put this one in here god this thumb keeps getting in the way that's the third one in and last but not least do the fourth one that's going into the final thing over here oh no ah uh, yep yeah. i think it's going in i think he's hint hinting to me that he needs to double of everything <laughs> what are you talking about there we go and that's all four of those with my crossover here let me just double check oh now that crossover seems a bit more weird than i intended wait a minute what's going on how has that turned like that <laughs> oh god okay that one's gone to there that one's gone to there i oh, know that has done what i wanted it to do that's cool right so there we go that is now in place looking just like that uh and once we've done that i believe that's it isn't it yeah we don't actually use this that's the top part of that but that is that all into place there looking pretty cool so we've done one whole arm pretty cool there we go god we got there in the end those springs are really hard really hard to do 
You went to Gates. Was Gates busy when you went there, Ian? We went to Essex on um, Sunday to drop the kiddies back. Oh, go on. My legs are aching tonight. Um, and all the garden centres there had like half hour, 45 minute queues. It was crazy. Absolutely crazy. Hello, Mike Bradley. How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> all the likes coming up. I think he's hinted to me he needs double of everything. What What are you talking about, Mrs. Worldaway? <laughs> I tried to order DC3, but it's constantly out of stock. Chris, I've been looking at that all day with a DC3. I said the victory. I don't know what's going on. They lower the price, and then they just don't let you order it. You cancelled your X-Wing. I haven't received an X-Wing delivery for ages, but that is now behind that board, the X-Wing. So when that comes... Uh, I will get cracking on it, but I'll probably do that in a live stream again because while we're building wings, we've seen it three times before. It's a it's a crazy build. It is Pat, Batman day, Batman pants day today. Bat, Batman lounging pants. I had my Marvel ones on yesterday. So Wayne or Milk just thinking about how to make a coffee. Oh, yeah, I, I think I need coffee. <laughs> Gates were sparse. I bet you at the weekend it's busy though. It should be fun. Um, when do we actually attach this arm? Any ideas? Is this coming up or is this in the next few? I do I do like how that's gone on there. It's absolutely brilliant, those springs. I'm just uh, playing with this Terminator arm. But yeah, I don't have a loose joint. It's uh, quite hard to turn it at the top. I don't know, this, this bit's quite tight here. Uh, put the fingers around there. I don't know. It looks all right. It certainly adds weight to it, that's for sure. The uh, hand can spin, as you can see that there. On that ball joint, the whole arm can turn, no problems at all. Uh, we're all right. But uh, I am quite impressed with that. We are coming to the end of that. We've got another, another leg to do, haven't we? And then basically it's gonna be all new stuff. I guess we're doing the chest plates and the back plates and then getting the, um, the hoop support on and then the base but uh yeah pretty good looking like that <laughs> um thanks mark smith i'm actually going in early friday morning but wayne has cancelled the stream to spend the evening with me i have i have we've been doing uh let's show you some of these we've been doing um Mrs. World of Wayne's got an advent calendar and what i've been doing is i've been doing codes for her and every day i've hidden one of these uh tokens here uh I, I did have one somewhere hang on i think there's one over here this is one of my my tested ones look if you can see it says look book token although she can spend it on uh, you see it needs clearing up and stuff like that it needs uh, she can spend it on doll's house stuff as well uh well i've been uh, just gone let's uh go back to that one then go on that one here we go um Let's see if any of you can get some of these pictures that I've done for her to guess. So the first one I did was this one. So can anyone tell me what word or words this says? Just realized you can't hear me. So what you're going to do is uh, I'm going to go back to it. I'm going to add a, a mic source to that. One second. <laughs> oh, what am I like? Right, hang on a second. Audio input. Lavalier mic. Okay. I'm not with it tonight, am I? There we go. Right, so now you can hear me. Right, okay. So there we go. That's the code. What do you think? That says, if you know music, you should be able to get that. So where did I hide her first token? Can anyone get that? Well done, Graham Loki. Dead beef. So I attached it to a steak in the freezer. <laughs> okay, right. You ready for the second one? This was day two. This was uh, theoretically today's one. Okay. You ready for this? Okay. This is where today's token was.
<laughs> you went for a COVID test today. Oh, yeah. That's Mrs. World of Wayne. I know, I was with you. <laughs> so come on, what does that say? Everyone's frantically looking. Any ideas? I'll give you a little bit of time. Do, 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 do. <laughs> it was steak. It's the only thing that I could do, Ian, <laughs> for, for steak, dead beef, out of musical notes. But uh, that was a challenge. But this one, this one was quite easy for uh, old Esther, this was, wasn't it? Does anybody know what that says? Baby Yoda. Well done. It was in Baby Yoda. It was actually Big Baby Yoda. So that's the one behind me. So that was... Um, now, I let her have one early because, uh, obviously, she's going into hospital. So the one she had yesterday was this one. Uh, and this stumped her for ages. Absolutely ages. And she tried to find the, uh, the meaning of the words. Ank meaning life, forte being the uh, uh, the prestige or the, the 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 section between the hilt and a uh, a blade of a sword. Centavo meaning century or a hundred. Uh, what she didn't realise was big baby. Yoda. <laughs> what she didn't realise was that is actually an anagram of Ark of the Covenant. So she did find it eventually in the Ark of the Covenant. And I do have one for her today, which I'm going to uh, I'm going to quickly flash up on the screen and then take down again. OK, she hasn't seen this yet, but this is going to be her one today. So. This is World Away, and I hope you're watching the screen very quickly because I'm only going to put it on there for a, a couple of seconds. One, two, three, four, five. There you go. That's going to be your one today. <laughs> Now, every time she gets one of these right, she gets a, a book token for five pound. So, uh, you know, the more she gets right, the, the more skint I am. So it's in my peace of mind not to <laughs> let her get them right. <laughs> oh, bless. It's all good. Ian, you wrote a game once with Egyptian coding. What do you mean, like hieroglyphics? Do you actually speak? No, we don't. She does this thing called um, Cozy Killer. When you're on Facebook, if you type in Cozy Killer, you'll see what she does. And basically, it's a monthly box of crypt crypto encryption stuff. I don't know. All clues, puzzles to solve a mystery. And that's what she's been doing last year. That came to an end last month for October. So I thought for, for her advent calendar this year, I will uh, I will do something nice for her. <laughs> and we did that. I mean, one year, about four or five years ago, wasn't it? You got me a Blu-ray a day. So on my advent calendar, I'd be opening a Blu-ray. And then obviously the world turned to streaming. So, <laughs> so they all got sold. <laughs> and she didn't like that very much at all. But do you know what that is then, uh, Esther? Do you know what that, that one is? Do you, know, do you know what that one is? Do you? <laughs> We will see. <laughs> oh bless. Um, so what else is going on next week? We've got, a, we've got the Super Snake. As I said, there is a delay in the Agora Terminator. So that's not going to be coming out for every 35 days now. We're not expecting that for another couple of weeks. And I think that will take us up to issue 80. Even though I know that uh, all the subscribers for Hashit one are well past 90. Um, but once the Super Snake's finished tomorrow, I guess the next one of that's going to be in the new year. That'll be the last pack for that. Um, the Cobra, that's going to be coming exactly the same time. There's normally about a week difference between the Cobra, which is now over there. Where's the Cobra? It's up there. It needs to be there. <laughs> um, so that's coming. I've still got two issues of the Ferrari F40. Very strange today, and today's one that it didn't tell us about those two parts that we didn't use. Someone told me we don't use them for a lot longer. So I don't know, but we've got the um, uh, the left and right turbochargers coming for that. And I've got them here. I've got the next two here. And as I said, on Friday, I will be doing the Bismarck. But uh, I don't know what number we're up to on that because we've got eight. Oh, it must be 88. We've got 88 here, which is a bit of a hole. And we've got some more photo etched parts by the look of it. 
Issue 89, we're not doing hardly anything at all. It's just a motor. And then issue 90, which I've got here. Again, doesn't look like much to do at all. But I've heard on the grapevine, because I have been watching, uh, I think Deadmar Models is doing the uh, Bismarck and Model Bauschmitz as well is doing it. Um, I've heard issue 91 is a bit of a nightmare. <laughs> and issue 97 has got some ladders which are going to make me tear my, uh, well, what I've got left of hair out. But we'll have to see. Your only advent calendar this year is from where? Or what? You, do you get a screwdriver a day? You get like a PHO, -O, PHO, PH1, PH2, PH3 until you get one this thick. <laughs> That'll be fun. <laughs> I'm just chucking this away here, no problems. But I said on the weekend because I'm gonna I'm gonna do things to take my mind off things with uh, Mrs. World of Wayne being in hospital. So I'm gonna uh, I've put it down somewhere. I'm gonna get to work on the Slimer that Ian sent me from part work upgrades because I want to get that built and I want to uh, while I'm doing that. I may as well do the uh, the pulse rifle as well. I think that's going to be my projects this weekend. Um, what are you doing for your next vacation? Well, we were going to go to Scotland uh, in January, Ian, or to get a, a log cabin or a cabin somewhere in the country just to get away from things. Because, you know, in the last like three or four months, it's just been hell, to be honest with you. So um, if we do do that, it will be last minute because our government keep closing things down and opening them up and <laughs> you got a ph1 bit today the case came yesterday <laughs> you need to get wayne a hat that pulls down to his nose oh god i do have a christmas hat i don't know if you saw it on the last streams i've got the uh the christmas hat that will uh with, uh, with the mickey mouse ears that's what i normally wear uh, i just want to check if i've got uh bear with me stand by again uh, some of my special effects that I used to use. I don't think I've got them anymore. Um, I've got overlays on here. No, I'm going to have to download them again. Because uh, when I do my stream, I did have a, a thing where I'd have snow falling down while I'm talking to you. And I was going to use the same effects for when I'm doing the Ghostbusters build. So not while I'm doing the build, but while I'm talking to you, I can have ghosts whizzing around my head <laughs> all over the place. Um, but we're getting that way. What with uh, Graham Loki sent me that Slimer just there, and I did have the... Um, Stape of Marshmallow Man as well. Uh, I've been trying to incorporate them in the thumbnails just to make them a little bit more uh, happy. <laughs> but it does include a screwdriver with bits and a small ratchet set. Wow. But um, the thing is, I, I don't remember, I don't recall having all my tweezers outside. Which makes me wonder where's my tweezers? Oh, uh, you know what? I know where my tweezers are. I know where they are. The um, the reason I can't find them, just to double check, is because I put them away. They come in a big uh, like pouch. I put them away in the pouch. So they are all outside. So you must show that picture I sent. Really? <laughs> um. Okay. Stand by. Ian bought this because he thinks it looks like, <laughs> like me. It's a it's a it's an in joke of um. Hang on a second. Uh. The last time we went to uh, Gates. Okay, so I need to save image. Onk. I do like all your little things there, uh, Ian, I have to say. Let me uh, stand by. Let me uh, downloads. No, pictures. That's the one. There we go. Uh, oop. Nope. Nope, that's too big. But God, what resolution did you send that picture in, Ian? It's ginormous. Okay, right, so that is there. There we go. This is what he's on about. So the little, he wants to, he wants me to dress up like this for Christmas. <laughs> I don't know if that goes, but I do like your other little things here. The C3PO, the Arden, what are they? They're not Funkos, are they? Are they some other brand? I don't know. What are they, Ian? You know, it looks like me. <laughs> what, what are your little things? They're not Funkos, are they? We don't have a copy of it, do we? I don't know. Why would you think we have a copy of it? We do have a copy of it. You mean the book? We do. I, I, by June, I think she's got it. 
She's going to be coming upstairs in a minute. <laughs> I think she's got it, people. Oh, my God. I can't believe she got it on stream. I thought that was hard. I think she's got this. There. <laughs> I know she's got it because she said that. So, basically, that is the Amazon in South America. And if you type in that code in the search box, it brings up Stephen King's it. I can't think what that's for, but we'll, uh, we'll have to say here. <laughs> she thinks her token is on page 579. I, I, I wouldn't know. You'd have to check. I'm not going to do the running around for you. <laughs> my advent calendar you'll be pleased to know is a mixture of chocolate which i haven't got any up here and vallejo paints so i've been uh, i've opened the mint green vallejo paint today that paint rack is getting filled out there so uh, i can't wait for that um if you didn't know um model designs unfortunately are having to move their premises from their premises back home because of the effects of covid and stuff so i don't think you'd be able to order anything from model designs for the time being uh, but when that's back up and running again i'll let you know but uh, if you have tried to order any of the workstations or paint racks, uh, I don't think you'd be able to at the moment. I haven't tried it, to be honest with you. So, the brand is Funko. Wow. I've got, I've got three Funkos here. That's it. That's all I own. Look. I've got Mr. Miyagi. <laughs> I've got Daniel LaRusso. And I've got Johnny Lawrence. And there was where the big baby Yoda was. Right in the middle there. Which is cool. I have to do a video for you of my collection, Wayne. Yes, definitely, Graham. Didn't you do one uh, from the Welcome to the Cave? I'm sure you did. Didn't you? I'm going to check. And there we go. Look, Graham, that's uh, low key. No, we didn't. I really thought you did, Graham. Wow. I wasn't aware of that at all. <laughs> I was going to say they look like Fungo. Yeah, I know there's another brand which makes slightly smaller ones, Richard. Because uh, I used to get some of them from Loot Crate. I had a Batman one. I think I've still got that somewhere, actually, upstairs. As a matter of fact, if anyone likes Toot like that, you know, like um, the little Batman figurines, a little Joker wooden toy, or any of the old Loot Crate stuff, I've got a drawer full of it upstairs, which is doing nothing with it, and I'll probably end up chucking it. So if, you, if anyone wants me to box it up, and perhaps do it as a giveaway or something then i'll uh i'll be happy to do that I, I i there's things in there that might appeal to people even like princess bride playing cards just thinking offhand a terminator plate which says terminator is like a metal plate um a star trek pin uh a falcon pin with he's doing that uh some comics i don't know she's found it <laughs> she's found the uh the token was that a good one yeah, excellent oh, God. Very quick again, you know. Yeah, I bet. You must have wrote that down ultra quick when I, I took a photo of it. Oh. <laughs> took a screenshot. Took a screenshot. God. That's another five pounds. <laughs> <laughs> if you want all that talk, well, I've got to get it together and I'll put it in a box. But uh, I, I, I think Loot Crate's back out, but I think they went bankrupt for a time and then they've come back on their... Uh, they're doing what they do again. My son, he gives... Um, oh, right, okay. My son does uh, the wrestling one, the wrestling crate. So uh, he's uh, he's collected. He likes all the WWE. As a matter of fact, I've got to go to the WWE next year with him. Oh, I think it's May. As long as everything's back on again, who knows? But uh, what I'll do is on social media, Ian Graham, I'll, I'll, I'll end on the Patreon channel. I'll take pictures of everything and just lay it all out because there is loads of stuff in here i did send one to someone called gerald champ gerald champ in america which was a captain america shield uh not the round one the original one that he had during like world war two i guess it was one one two i can't remember um and uh a terminator head that that came with it as well but uh can you believe she got that that quick I've got another one on here, but she can bloody wait for that now, because that was tomorrow's one that she solved already now. Typical, isn't it? <laughs> but anyway, look, we're finishing early tonight. It's quarter two because I've done everything, and uh, I'm going to actually get something to eat because I've been drinking too much beer and not eating enough. 
So I really do hope you liked that stream tonight. I know it's uh, only 45 minutes. Uh, keep a lookout for this tomorrow. This is going to be hard because A, it's heavy, and B, it doesn't look like a lot to do. Normally when that happens, it means like we're going to have hell of a lot to do. So uh, when that comes around, uh, we're going to have that on the shelf. It's going to look pretty impressive. So, uh, But as I said, I will keep you informed about Mrs. World of Wayne on Friday because there is no live stream tomorrow. And uh, as soon as I know something, I'll let you know she's all okay. But uh, listen, take care of yourselves and I will...